this CC01 chassis is bone stock. I just added a sealed ball bearing kit and switched out Philips screws with hex hardware where it was possible. I also installed a 35 turn motor and a 1080 Hobbywing ESC. The servo is from Hobbyking. I quickly realized that the 35 turn motor with the stock gearing is way too quick for a scaler or crawler rig. There are aftermarket options available in the form of gear reduction units, for example from HPI. But I will try a 55 turn motor and see how that works. Nevertheless, it's quite funny. The suspension in stock form, especially in the rear, is quite lackluster to say the least. Articulation is really bad, but in my test here, I found that for driving with moderate speed over these bumps, the C01 performed surprisingly well. Body rolls can happen at higher speed, but it's a crawler after all. The stock tires are garbage. They are from a very hard compound and I had really problems to find a grip anywhere else than on asphalt. New dedicated crawler tires are a must have to improve the performance of the CC01. This is the reason most of you buy a CC01. It's for the looks. And I have to say, here it delivers right out of the box. The hard plastic body looks awesome and very realistic. Only the tinted windows are a small negative in my opinion. But if you do not want to buy or build an interior, it could also be a goodie for you. As I said before, the stock tires are really bad and as you know a lot of the performance from a crawler comes from a good tire choice. The CC01's ability to crawl is not the best right out of the box. But right now I can't tell exactly how much influence the tires have here. But for my feeling it's a lot. Therefore I ordered a set of RC 4-wheel drive Goodyear Wrangler 1.55 scale tires. Articulation leaves also room for improvement and ground clearance is also not the best. There are ways to improve that and I will show you in upcoming videos how to do that. This part of my quick overview isn't really informative, but I had so much fun in the mud with the CC01 that I just wanted to show you some of the shots here. Due to the awesome scale look, it was a real pleasure to watch the little Pachero work its way through the mud holes in my local forest. And surprisingly, the tires did a good job here.
If you plan on running your rig in wet conditions, be sure to install waterproof electronics and clean and dry your chassis and body after use. I'll do that off camera. Well, that was my quick review of my Tamiya CC01 after the first extended run. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and or leave me a comment below. And if you want, subscribe. And thank you for watching.